Well, what a day it was here at 76ers Fieldhouse as the Blue Coats improved their record to 11 and 8 on the season. They snap a four game losing streak, and a big reason for why that was possible began with this guy right here, Chris Kamaji, with his first career triple double at the G League level. How did that feel? <coughs> it felt great. Uh, I didn't even know I had 10 blocks. So when I came out the game, uh, the last minute, uh, one of the coaches came up to me and they're like, yo, uh, I know, you know, you were frustrated during the game, but you had 10 blocks. I was oh, oh, that's cool. And then, yeah, it's just, you know, I'm glad we got the win with it, so definitely. If we go back to the beginning of the season, I think one of the things that you worked really hard on was to avoid getting in foul trouble. Mm -hmm. And you've really improved in that regard. And that has allowed you to play longer minutes mm -hmm. and then have the activity that you like to have not maybe always to 10 blocks, but you are leading the league in block shots. What's the key for you to get those swats? Uh, you know, coming into the season, uh, Coach Kano always told me, like, you know, just to, like, you know, not leave my feet, you know, just work on my verticality. And in practice, we've been working on that all the time. So that's just, like, you know, see that come to action and, you know, me being out there blocking shots or altering shot without getting in foul trouble, being on the court and helping my teammates, that's just, you know, very significant. Uh, for the team and also to me. Because I think also your footwork, because they're not all the blocks weren't all in the paint. Like you ran out to block a shot on a jumper. Mm -hmm. So what is it defensively you're trying to do in terms of being not just under the <coughs> rim, but your activity elsewhere on the floor? I mean, I'm pretty mobile, you know, just from my background playing soccer. So, you know, when I'm on the court, I try to cover as much ground as I can, uh, you know, get out to the three-point line. Uh, you know, like the, the three-point line here is, you know, much larger than the one in high school and college, you know, so you just, you know, you got to just like work on your anticipation, know when the guy is shooting and just, you know, on your timing. Timing is the most important thing. How about in terms of your scoring? Because I know the last time we were in this building, I saw a Euro step that you connected on. It's not always just mm -hmm. a lob at the rim. What do you want to do offensively to grow your game? Oh, just, you know, just being out there, you know, more, the more you play, the more experience, the more feel, the feel you get for the game. So just, you know, take what the defense give me, you know, uh, if, if they sag enough and, you know, I'm, I got the ball and I'm closer to the paint, you know, work on my attach around the paint, you know, those floaters and stuff like that, hook shots, because you're not always going to be able to dunk it. So, you know, just work on my attach. <laughs> Congratulations. It was so fun to watch. I can tell Thank the you. crowd. They find you to be a, uh, like a fan favorite. Can you feel that, the energy in the building? When yeah. You, yeah, it was great. Uh, again, Chris Kamaji with a career triple-double, 12 points, 16 boards, and 10 block shots. And to top it off, the Blue Coats get the victory, 111 to 88. Thanks for being with us. Thank you.